Hey everybody, what's going on? My name is Omega Jinchi, and welcome back to Skull and Bones. And that's take your opportunity to get a chance to control this manufacturer. Whatever. Ah. So I had to do this mission to unlock his buy mission. Eat your fill. Keep up your strength. A breach falls. Look at the reaches, no doubt. Right, I'm only using level twos, right? Yeah. Which is not really ideal for a brigantine. I should be using level threes. Make it in like 25 seconds? Probably not. Oh, is that what that guy was doing here? Oh, that's what this guy was doing here that I helped out. This was.
Ah, so that's what I helped him with. But because I didn't join it, I didn't get like anything for it other than just helping him out. I wonder, I'm like, who the hell is shooting like a whole life of mortars at me? Get out of here right Level rank two now. Yeah, there you go. Eat, eat, eat. Yeah, secure full progress by destroying the enemies and completing the takeover. Yeah, I should actually be getting all this stuff too. Hell 
Oh, crew body. Get him. Um, I get a question what she's doing. First come, first serve. Oh, wait. I think it's making stuff. I'm not sure how that shit's working now. So I am now level two, almost level three. Holy crap. Man, why does it seem like it's easier to level up Kingpin than it was to fucking actually level up two Kingpin? I'm like, why is it so stubby? Yeah. So I had to complete. The, I had to complete that mission, which then now unlocked the. Um... Oh, this is it gonna hurt? Gonna be bumper cars or bumper boats? Who? Tobacco leaves, you say? Don't mind if I do.
<laughs> Shadow 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 Thank you. Get some grub in your belly. <laughs> what I get King Ping chest. All right, sweet cargo. Do you mind what do you repair long gun? Oh, bloody hell, really? Why repair guns? Like, do these do any actual damage other than I can repair my friends? That bit of business progressing. Eh, done. Ha! Huh. Your first manufacturer in hand. A promising start, Galvi. <laughs> Let the profits flow. <laughs> there are many ways to grow one's empire. It is not always about whose ship has the biggest cannons in her belly. I am sure you're excited to see your new holding begin to churn out profits. But these are trade secrets, Captain. Let us head into your office. Last time you told me to go into my office, I ended up getting locked in my office. Your factory workers need capital to start production. See to it, they always have enough funds. This is just the start, Captain. Use force or underhanded means to secure more manufactories and put them to your use. You can keep track of your growing empire in this very office. And what coin you reap should be sewn back into your operations. Okay. Idle fund. Um. Funding for an hour. Okay. Takes a hundred pieces to upgrade it to where then, huh? Be strategic, maneuver and shape how territories and trade routes will benefit your empire. Thus, your reach will grow, as will your profits. And the helm rewards the most enterprising of kingpins. Surpass your rivals as the highest earning kingpin and gain access to our finest rewards, Galbi. Here, a little something to put you in a buying mood. Welcome to the abyss, Captain. The helm steers all. Cool. Manufacturing is producing new product and will automatically sell to its smugglers. Generates pieces of aid that you can use to purchase on the black market and upgrade other manufacturers. It takes time to produce and smuggle the contraband. Once profits have been generated, you will need to collect them from the manufacturer. And speed up the process by applying raw materials to your manufacturers. Ugh. 
So what, I have to now wait an hour? Collect your earnings from your manufacturing business once operations have generated profits. What happened? No, okay, so. It says I have to finish that mission, but I wonder if I just. How do I go up to him now? So, the helm grants you a larger office. Just remember that I offer. Hmm. Okay, still can't. There are still uh. those who scheme against me. Everyone wants a piece of this empire that I've built. And they're all crook other pirates. The Farah. Uh. Uh, I wouldn't trust anyone. Proven that with time. The same cannot be said of others. You know, Cully, I almost missed that uppity French frog. Caradet was a huge problem, but he was only one man. Killing him has changed things. My enemies cling tighter to the shadows now. Oh, yeah, you did a power vacuum, my friend. Godspeed. Okay. Deliver forty sugar cane, okay. Consider this your second ship, dear Captain. Mm hmm. Stories sometimes. Hmm. Always a room for you. Um.
There we go. Must find ships that have sugar cane. Great warship, Captain! That over there! What is it? I need sugar cane. That merchant looks to be carrying something special. Now I could have just actually what I or what I should have done was looked at missions to attack ships for him. That would have been the smarter thing to do. That of coming out here looking for smuggling ships. Down the hatch. Yeah. Um, oh. I did accidentally smoke into him by accident. But I'm glad that I kind of didn't start a fight there. Jupiter Bears. I don't need Jupiter Bears. Poppy. Viola needs you lost in fighting shape. Mm -hmm.
Whoa, bridge right packed. Whoa. Take all the shit. Are you the one I want? Are you, uh, yes you are. Get back here, I'm keeping, I'm getting your puppy. Your booty is mine, shippy. I need those poppies for my own drugs. Ah, he missed that last shot. Now it's the time to blow. Uh, do the right. I don't think that's gonna hit him. Oh, uh, nope, that missed. Thank you. I will take all your puppies. I need forty. Where's another small lizard? You got poppy on you? No, you're safe. What about you? you could, no, you're safe. That's an island. Okay, I at least got 17 so far. Ow. Oh. Oh, what is this? Was trying to get to Saint Anne. I kind of sailed past it. To me to my smuggling ring. Spy network. All right, forty eight. I pop you for sale. Oh wait, no, they need sugar cane. That's right, they need sugar cane. I need sugar cane. Um, CN has put a shipment of sugar cane for sale. Oh, okay, those. Where do I? What can I attack? A rogue hunt, that's what I want. Number cord. All right, now where's their contract?
All right, gotta sink a cargo ship for some sugar cane. That's so you know what? I wonder if he can actually join or not. But have more grilled food. That's all you fuckers get, grilled food. Until we run out. So I think it was, yeah, it was, yeah, sugar cane. So I got poppies. And there's my convoy. Um, actually, I don't know. I think I still, I don't know. It's past those company men. We need to better use the wheel. It's those company men. On our starboard. There they are. Ah. Oh no. Alright, uh, just get up. Little closer. Little closer. Little closer. Just a little, little closer. Just, just a little. Just, there we go. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah. Whoa, fire! Burn him! Oh my lord! I burst through my shields like motherfuckers. Oh. Whoa. That ship hurt. Oh, it's a bird. Oh, my orders. It's a bird. Take all that stuff. Ah, thank you, thank you.
All right, have you. Head to that outpost so I can then do fast travel. And also repair my ship. Uh, so my smuggling thing is over there, I think. This is an outpost, Captain! We can be dead! Captain, she's brand new! She's not really brand new. Right, he might still be on vacation, so I just leave the party. Right, right, right. He might still be on vacation for all I know. Uh, I got another. Wait, I already leveled up again. Oh, I got fifty. Of that's coins. Cool. Now I got to drop off the sugar can to now. Yeah. Supply run inactive. Oh wait, do I have to, I wonder do I have to thirty five more minutes. I wonder if I like give them the sugar game. For it. Oh yeah, all this stuff. Okay. Parachute. Fast travel. What is closest? I haven't discovered that post yet to even be able to So I have to travel down there. <sighs> oh. How many did you see today? Yeesh. Fire bombards. Fire bombards of three, you say. Take stuff into my inventory, my warehouse, you say. My best client has returned. Do you need more storage space? Uh, no, I don't think I do. All right, I should definitely start cooking all this frickin' food. That stuff in my inventory now. Yes, good. That's it. Hmm. 
I wonder. Oh, what is? Oh, we gotta build into the wall. Yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. uh, now we're just doing smuggling stuff. Yeah. Yeah, when you reach Kingpin level one, you unlock uh, a whole new tier to the smuggling ring. Oh, cool. Yeah. Basically, you go and do uh, events that are either PvP or co op. To take over manufacturing uh, points throughout the maps. Oh, cool. Yeah, uh, it's a way that like they'll gather material. Um, right now, the manufacturer I just got takes an hour, and then it'll go and sell the resources, and you'll get uh, pieces of eight from it. Oh, right. Really? Yeah. I'm literally now in the spam of, I think, 40 minutes since I said I was Kingpin 1. I'm now Kingpin 3, almost 4. <laughs> and I've only just been destroying ships. Oh. Go the wrong goddamn direction. Yeah, I'm Kingpin 3 now, halfway to, uh, about halfway to level 4 now. I didn't plan my vacation at all, the internet was, there was too shit. That is edible. I figured you're still on your vacation, so that's why, like, I, I joined the party, then I realized, and then left it. No, I, I couldn't, I couldn't play at all. I did try, though. I tested it with the Xbox Game Pass first. Um, just so that if I got disconnected, my PlayStation isn't left on. And yeah. It couldn't. It couldn't do it. It couldn't do Game Pass. So yeah, fuck it. There's no way it's gonna stream my system either. <clears throat> but anyway, I Lindsay wanted to play Overcook 2 on my Switch. I didn't have it downloaded. The game's like 20 gigs. It took almost a whole day to download on hotel Wi-Fi. Oh, that fucking sucks. It's, it's so slow. I was expecting to come back and like my coworker to at least caught up or passed me in Persona 3, but she's barely played it. I checked her trophy list and I'm like, oh fuck, I'm way ahead. Still? <laughs> yeah, hey, that's all I've been playing is this. I've just been streaming Skull and Bones like all week. Probably play some soon. I want to get back into it. Uh, Crony's picking it up on the 29th, he said. Oh, the 29th is Final Fantasy Part 2. Yeah, I've seen that it's got 8s and 9s. Yep. Game I was eight. hoping to be done this by then, but I don't know if it's possible. Maybe if I have a day off. Oh, well, maybe. Uh, now I don't know how the fuck this is supposed to work. Let's see if I interact with it? I just fucking call and sick a day. Stay at home. I wouldn't do that though. I don't I don't like doing that. Save it for when I'm actually sick. Oh start supply run plus two hundred percent. Oh, I went out and got the fucking like sugar cane for them. I didn't realize I had to come here and do a mission for it. I could summon a persona called Pazuzu. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, okay, return to the manufacturer, so if I lose the pieces of A to have on board. 
I just returned to the manufacturer. Oh. There's a person with Tempest Slash. Oh, tomorrow's gonna suck. Oi, Crony's going out of okay. town, so it's only down to like me and two other people on the friggin' D&D. Funny, I'm like Kingpin three, almost four, and I barely have touched the story. Touched the story. I've been like running around doing like I've got a few blueprints. My ship's at level nine now. Fuck the last ship you get, you actually have to buy from the uh, black market. Squeeze, tight squeeze. Um, came across my first like bug in the game. Uh. Yeah. Um, uh, when I was unlocking the manufacturing stuff for the smuggling ring. Um, it has, it tells you to like, interact with the map, uh, or the table, and start the, uh, event for the takeover. It essentially started your Kingpin Empire, keep expanding your empire to become Kingpin of the Indian Ocean. These rewards, check out the leaderboard. Oh yeah, there's now, there's a leaderboard in the game. But yeah, so, um, I sat there and went to the upgrade table um while i was on like the on that table for the hostile takeover and decided to upgrade my uh, my one manufacturing thing even though it says like it'll reset in like three days i was like fucking why not and doing so i uh basically broke the game to where I was stuck in the smuggler's den. I couldn't leave. I couldn't interact with anything. I couldn't, like, pop up, like, the start menu. I couldn't do anything. I was just sitting there running around. So I had to, like, close the game and boot it back up. Oh, I have to... Oh, I just had to go back to this ship. Okay, is it still... Are they on my... So... Well, I have sure can to whatever the hell I need it. It's a good day when you're on deck. Alright, so let's see. What can I buy from the... Uh, black market now. Literally nothing. Best wishes, friend. Also discovered that there is, well, four 
sets of currencies in the game. There's the silver, the pieces of eight, sovereigns, and gold. Which is the, the gold is the paint currency. Yeah, I knew that. Yeah, because yeah. like there's your standard silver, there's the pay currency, there's the pieces of eight, and there's the ones that are like the the sovereigns are like the little square ones, aren't they? Yeah, they're like they're like the pieces of eight, but more detailed. They're the they're the seasonal leaderboard currency. Leaderboard allows the helm to track the overall progress campaigns in a season. Calculated by your progress over the weeks. The pirates, well, the, oh, the more pieces of eight you earn, the higher season reward tiers, and the more sovereigns you will receive. As the mark of the helm's favor, the top eight kingpins will also receive an exclusive cosmetic set to flaunt. Win, fair winds, and fat purses kingpins. Consists of weekly and seasonal leaderboards. I'll try to blah blah blah. blah. Try to do the smugglers to raid. This is eight throughout the week. Higher weekly tiers, the more yada yada. All right, so let's see. I am seventy-one thousand five hundred and fifty-one in the leaderboard for the seasonal. Which resets in 87 days. And I am 60,476 in the weekly. So I'm at least higher in the weekly. <laughs> well, I can't see who, like, number one is. I can only see who's near me. <laughs> so I'm currently a bronze. Oh, I need to have... Ten, I think it's... If I have 10,000 pieces of eight, I get 350 sovereigns. But the one guy, um, the one video I was watching earlier, the guy had, like, the majority of the map, like, it was all in red. Like, he, like, because you can buy each section, and, like, it's, like, a certain amount of price. I think it's this one. So to unlock the coast of Africa, it'll cost me 5,000 uh, pieces of eight. Or you can just go there. Like, no, no, no. No, like to unlock the the empire for it. So unlock all these smuggling areas, like the, uh, the manufacturers. Oh, I see. Yep. Yeah. As you get the Red Isles for free. And then the uh, East Indians and the coast of Africa cost 5000 to unlock them. And then there's nothing in the open sea. Okay, so I wonder if that now unlocks his store. Because apparently it's... Gerlock has uh, a buy and sell. That once you become a kingpin and do the the mission for the emperor empire stuff, he unlocks uh, you unlock his buy and sell option. Heard you got yourself a brigantine. Good for raiding, she is the swiftest of her class. Yeah, there it is. Buy and sell. 
All right, what do I need for his? What do I need for it? Gold skull rum. I need a thousand. White skull rum, okay. I need a thousand white skull rum so I can then buy his um, his blueprint for his cannons. That's a lot of sugar cane. Yep. Keep your eyes oh, back. fuck. I had fucking Doritos and I left them upstairs. Shit. I bought uh, ketchup chips and smart food popcorn. It's on sale for two... Uh, 288 at Food Basics. keep like running to the helm and I'm like I keep forgetting I can just hit fucking R1 and be teleported to it white skull rum yeah so I gotta make there's 50 how much do I have in total at least right now I think I have like 80 I have 139 so far. And I am not selling a fucking bit until I reach a thousand. <laughs> so I want that blueprint. Just go get, do some source missions or whatever they're called. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I've been just been kind of checking the blacksmith regarding like upgrading my ship your reputation rings louder than a 36 oh, what do you got banner. like right now I have on uh, the bastion 3 which is an armor of 340 and it, ha it does 29 to fire and 29 to piercing. But the one I want to get. Eh, where the hell was I was looking at? I quit the grog long ago. Is this one? Yeah. The Black Prince. It does 35 explosion, 18 fire, and 20 piercing. And it's 400, and it's got a 1200 armor. But the thing that sucks about it is I have to buy it from one of the, uh, the helm uh, merchants. And it costs sovereign, uh, sovereigns. I think it's like 300 sovereigns for it. Let's do some business. Yeah, let me see. Where was it? Yeah, 450 sovereigns for the armor. And I don't think I can unlock the blueprint. I think I have to straight up buy it. I better check the stocks. Don't want to run low. Hmm. 
2,800 pieces of eight for the mortar three. Why is everything got to be behind so much crap? Following seas. Hi, Mika. Going good. Um, I had to restart the stream. The game bugged out on me. Here, that was quick. You must enjoy my surly company then. Uh, boop, 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 boop. Yeah. What do you do? It increases charge rate and increase piercing. Oh, go down, you stupid kid. So, how was Hell's Irish 2? Yeah, purchase. Purchase. Which, man, I forget what cannons I even have on my ship. Uh, oh yeah, Basilisk too, so I had a... <laughs> Sherlock... Oh yeah, the, the Mons Meg one. Here, that was quick. You must enjoy my surly company then. Wait, I could have sworn I built that. I could have sworn I built the... Oh, no, yeah, I built the mortars. That was it. Here, that was quick. You must enjoy my surly company, then. Oh, there's another wrong one. Purchase, purchase, purchase. Oh my god. Oh. Actually, I don't really need to purchase the fire bombs three because I just got them <clears> from <throat> uh, leveling up. Nice. Yeah, each time you level up in the kingpin, you get, uh, you just get a chest. I, uh, I wasn't aware that you could upgrade the fire bombs. Where do they go when you equip them? They just go? No, like, the uh, fireball cannons. Oh, sorry, I thought you meant the ones that they throw when you get close. Oh, no, um, no, I think you can actually increase them, or at least increase... Oh, uh, Mika says hi. Oh, hello. Um... I know there's the, like, equipment you can increase, um, like, I think, like, how much damage they do when they throw them. Okay. Um, I think from the, I think it's in the carpenter. Yeah, the carpenter, you gotta buy, like, make all that stuff. All right, because you consider it a tool. Okay. Yeah, so I think it's, like... Elemental damage, increased damage from ramming. Yeah, there is a few of them where it's like increase uh, maximum range of the demi cannon. So, so yeah, increase the crew attack damage by ten. So I think that would be like it's the boatswain's call, and that might uh, I think that increases like their attack. Well, yeah, increases their attack. I think, uh, there's one I saw. Yeah, increase the duration of the ablaze. Damn it, where was it? There was one I had on 
Or I saw it, it increases their uh, their damage with the muskets. Dude, any reason they shot muskets? Yeah. <laughs> they can shoot muskets, they can throw bombs. Uh, I think it really depends on the ship you have. Uh. Increases. My Baba taught me woodwork. Any of the target? Hi, Lucky. This is all trimming. Flood in a blaze. The only thing that uh, I, I actually posted this on their Twitter um, when they posted about the um, the season that starts, I think, next week. Um, like their season one, mm -hmm. I, I sat there and I commented about how, like, I would like to see them, uh, revamp the repair kits. Like the amount that they give is okay, but the cooldown is ridiculous. I like repair kit one takes 30 seconds. Two takes 60 seconds. And repair three takes 90 seconds. Yeah. And um, when you put in the like the automatic repair, it will pick the best repair kit for you. And no matter which one you use, it cooldowns all of them. So you can't just be like use a repair three and then go to a repair one. So. I commented saying, like, it would be nice if they fixed that. And um, so far, it's kind of about, like, three or four people have been kind of getting into an argument over it. On the com like, my com one guy said, like, it would have been better if they uh, made, like, the Dark Zone from, like, the Division. Made, like, a specific PvP-only area. Right. Uh, because I commented saying he, he, the person was like, "Oh, it won't work if they did that. Like it would make PvP useless." And I'm like, "Well, they could make it to where the health kits are the same for PvP, like what they are right now, but then make them different for PvE, so their effects would be completely different." Or implement like re like refix what they are right now but then implement uh actually pvp only repair kits that will only work in pvp and not pve situations kind of like um like what see you later kind of like what um dc universe does where they have the gear set. They have a PvE gear set and a PvP gear set. Hi, kitty. Which side are you going to be on, little one? Uh, oh, yeah. Oh, shit. I wanted to, wanted to mess with my ship. So. Funny thing is, I scat. I went around. I sailed around to get the fucking upgrades for the Moon Mag, one like can uh, bombard cannons that I have to unlock the fire bombs bombardade cannons, which are 98, which is nice. But I just don't like the look of them. So, what is my least, what is my lowest thing now? Mike. Alright, so. My mortars. My mortar and my, my long gun are my lowest. And I just upgraded my mortar to a level 2. Uh. 
really sucks that I can't have like more than one um, major function on a ship. Alright, so I need to make a lot of sugar cane, or get a lot of sugar cane. Quick, you must enjoy my surly company then. I did get a repair mortar, but my only problem with the repair mortar is I have no idea if it actually does any damage to enemies because it doesn't say that it does right. it just has it just has the no how much it repairs when you fire upon a friendly it's like that's nice but i want to know how much damage it does to an enemy because if it's not going to do any damage then i'm not going to put it on my ship Yeah, mortars three I have to unlock. Basically, all the other stuff I have to now uh, make for my ship. I need precision drilling bits. Which, so far, the only places I've found that give me them are forts. Oh, someone's doing a hostile takeover. Yeah, hostile takeover events. Next, oh, next, oh, okay, so people can take over stuff. Fuck okay, it, I'm right there. Nobody else is going to be doing it. I'm going to take it over. Lady, I don't care if people seize my crap. Funny thing is, when I was sailing around earlier, I actually helped a guy do a hostile takeover without realizing what the hell it was. Like... I, just, like, I came, around, came across them just fighting a bunch of ships, so I was like, I'll help this dude, this random guy out. What's a hostile takeover versus the plunder? Is that when you attack like one of the major cities? Yeah, you basically you're you're attacking an operation, and it's um. Like I said, it can be a PvP event or a PvE event, like a co-op event. So, um, it's like the other, like, world, like, PvE world events or PvP, mm -hmm. where it pops up and tells you, like, do you want to join? Oh. And yeah, you join and you fight over, like, who's gonna, like, take it, take the base over. As, like, you find out that, um, certain bases have like hidden um, hidden areas or hidden um, helms 
And yeah, if you take it over, you can then set it to like produce uh, materials for you, so you can then like get uh, pieces of eight. It's basically just like um, the drug running in Grand Theft Auto. Right. Um, but yeah, once you take it over, you can do like supply runs for it. Um, you can upgrade it, which produces like one more um, like pieces of eight. And I think if you upgrade it more, it'll get to like sovereigns and stuff. So yeah, when you're doing a hostile takeover, because it pops up to everybody who has that the emperor empire unlocked. So then you just go. And it'll tell you, like, so me and three other people, like, actual people, can fight over this area. But if you don't have the helm, you just come in and you can, like, sit there and just shoot up the ships and get XP. <laughs> I did... Last night when I was playing, I kept coming across the same uh, guy on uh, who was from on PlayStation, and I kept helping him with all his events because he was asking for help for stuff. And like he was just like, I'm like sailing around doing like missions and stuff, and I kept coming across him, so I kept helping him like take over bases and stuff. And he kept sending me like group invites. He sent me a friend invite, and I was like declining everything. I'm like, I'm here to, like, destroy shit. I'm not here to help you. I'm just a mysterious stranger. I show up in your time of need and sail off. Yeah. I'm, I'm, uh, tuxedo mask. A Dow. A Snow. Well, that dude's got trigger cane on him. Though he's a player, though. Well. I'm literally the only... Okay, so far, two seconds until this takeover starts. So it's going to be eight minutes. I have to... Yeah, secure full progress by destroying enemy ships... I destroyed enemies to uh, completely take it over. And it actually, even though it's an eight minute mission, it actually goes pretty fast. Uh, yeah, so basically the main difference be between the two is uh, how I don't have to worry about the sh city shooting at me. I don't have. To, I don't also get like if you're not raiding the city, so you don't get loot from the city for raiding it or for hot for taking it uh, the hostile takeover. Holy crap! There's like five little ships trying to kick my ass right now. They're all level five. by the city too now <clears throat> holy crap and the fish people really want want to keep this logging company
Oh. I don't think my little more ship can take more. God damn, they're shooting me with like sticks basically. They do a lot of damage. <laughs> yeah, I'm real funny shooting things to you, Okay. Yeah. There's like, there's all, like about five, six of them, and then I have like a private uh, smuggler coming into the area now. Ugh. Also, I don't really praise very much. That one guy's like, there's a player outside the area. I think he's just wondering why I'm like attack, you know, getting attacked by a bunch of ships. I really wish there was a fucking auto loot system. I know there's an auto harvest. Yeah, yeah, I took it over. Fuck yeah. Interact. Now that I took it over, I can plunder it, which is even more hilarious. Can I not? Oh. No, I didn't want to. I want to. You okay, kitty? Can I interact with my lumber yet? Nope. I have to sail away because I'm hostile with them right now. Oh, you're sailing, uh huh? You have sugarcane, and you have sugarcane. And your smuggler ships.
Like, go. I don't know what you have, but I'm gonna take it. Jupiter bears. The guy like. Oh, I think he got a butt kicked by that smuggler ship. So, um, they haven't, I think it comes up today. There, I think it's when the pre or I know the wish list went up yes, earlier today for, uh, Scala, uh, for Sea of Thieves and, uh, Grounded. No price attack yet, I've seen. No, not yet. Uh, Hi Fi Rush did have its price attached, and it's the exact same price it is on Xbox, which is $38.99. Okay. Yeah. I was like, that was my like, like my one concern is like, if it's, if there's gonna be a price, are they gonna like overcharge on like the PlayStation version? <clears throat> like like that I, one. I don't mind double dipping if the price is right, and I could transfer progress. If I can't yeah. transfer my progress, big fucking nope. I <laughs> just I can't do it. No, I fucking wouldn't either. Like, I put too much time. Now, right? Oh. Oh, it's idle right now. Why is it idle? Oh, because I haven't done anything with it. There we go. So it costs 500, or at least for the ones around the area in the Red Isle, uh, to. Because you have to. Do like, um, like in GTA, you have to bring the drugs to the area to get them running. Yep. So it costs five hundred uh, silver to do that, and then you can do supply runs, which I think uh, increase like decreases the time you gotta wait. <clears throat> the only thing that sucks is you have to actually go to the places to uh, collect the money. Wait, am I doing that? Oh, no. Okay, I supply... Run activate plus two hundred percent. Oh, okay. I just had to go to an activate. I thought I was having to smuggle for them. Okay, so when you activate that, the supply run uh, for fifteen minutes, it increases how much the profit's going to be for you. So originally I was at 50, now I'm going to get 70 coins an hour. Or 75 coins an hour. For the net, for 15 minutes, for, I think for the next 15 minutes. I think that's how that fucking works, I don't know. Shit's kind of confusing. But now because I have a manufacturer there, I can still go small, uh... Plunder the city. Ain't 
Yeah, so far as I've seen on, at least on uh, Twitter, they haven't said anything about cross progression. They've said cross play. And they've talked a lot about community when it comes to Sea of Thieves. Meow. I have to find out. Yeah. All right. I was in process of building a new ship when I last played. That's what I'm gonna do. All right. Well, all I'm doing is I'm sailing around doing smuggling stuff. I haven't even touched the story. What do you need? I don't want a secure passage for you. I did do one of those um, missions where they're asking, like the ships are asking for help. And the one I did is they wanted a repair kit. I, and I, they gave me 500 silver for it. Oh, nice. Yeah, I was like, okay, here you go. <laughs> I'm like, I got some repair kits on me. Here you go. Uh, which, uh, what ship are you building? The one you had before when I stopped playing for the vacation. The pot oh, of the, or whatever. Yeah, the bombardment or whatever. Yeah. Well, if you need help, let me know. I'm just gathering materials. If the area is too tough, then yeah, but I'll see. I should be okay. I'll find out soon. Well, that, and like, if you need help, like, gathering materials, too. I mean, I think if we could just join each other's groups anyway, and it'll make our fights harder, but our rewards will be better. Even yeah. If we're not together. Uh, so I'm fighting level 6. I should be able to handle that. Alright. Well, yeah, I got a wood joining, but again, like, your thing keeps, I think, is that private? Is it off again? Hold on. Or still? Yeah, yeah, because it was on. No, it's not private. Oh, wait. The Ubisoft thing might be. Hold on. Yeah, yeah, the Ubisoft thing. It should tell you when you go to your social at the very bottom what your privacy set is. Oh, you like to show off. Oh, no, hold on. Uh, invite only, yeah. Yeah, that's what I have mine set to, is invite only. Yeah, friends only. I only have, like, one other friend playing it, so he's done on me now. You're, you're literally the only other person out of my friends list who has this game. I'm off to go take down a foundry for stealing gets. I am check I am grabbing some silver from my moving, one Roscoe. company. Oh, I think I need that stuff. Crude salt feeder. Oh, I have enough. Do you need ironwood planks though? I'm gonna take that ship out just for you. Let's see. Give me a plank. There we go. I wonder if I can still collect, even if it gets taken over by somebody else. I just had a ship hit me. It literally turned into me while I was turning around. Uh, where are... Oh, you're over there. What the? All oh, right, because I have the pieces of eight on my ship right now, so I'm getting attacked. Oh, really? It's like one of those currencies? Yeah. Until you, yeah, and when you get it from your manufacturers, 
It, until you get back to your den, yeah, you get attacked. What was the one from fucking Pirates of the Caribbean? The pieces of whatever. Yeah, uh, the there's a yeah, the uh, pieces of eight. Well, there are more than eight pieces. Oh, there's eight left behind. I think is yeah. what it was. They found all of them, but eight. They spent them all. They were find them. Something like that. Ah, oh, I fucking missed. Fire muskets! How you're able to aim that fucking far with muskets, I will never know. Fuck, muskets can barely hit targets like 30 feet in front. Yeah. They're, like, They're notoriously, notoriously inaccurate. I was able to hit like a freaking ship a good distance away from me. Uh, I keep my mist. That's bullshit. Eat your fill. Keep up your strength. I gotta go back to port anyways to get my next treasure chest to see what I unlocked. Just fucking miss this thing all the time. Before. Are you close? Uh, fuck! What was it um, earlier when I was playing the game? Um, came across it was around. Fuck! I think it was around the open seas, or it was the East Indians area. It was a fucking ghost ship. Oh, cool. Yeah. That's fucking cool. It was an elite. And as a level 9, I like, I barely was doing any fucking damage to it. And yeah, it was like Davy Jones, and it looked super freaking cool. Like, where was it? It was around, uh. Yeah. It was around, it was in the open ocean around the, uh. The Dutchman's camp. It was like a ghost ship. And the thing looked fucking awesome. Where you walk, death yes, praise my name, even though you assholes belittled me when I first came on. Oh god, five silver chests. Okay, and what do I get? Taryn Cullivan 3. It's a 98. I wonder if I can give that to you. Glory 
I don't even have to sink this other ship that showed up. The fucking other NPCs in here are doing it for me. <laughs> oh. Rival faction, obviously. Oh, probably. There. I'll put it on. I'll take it off my long guns. It makes me a level 10 now. I can't live without the long guns. They're too good. I know, but it was my oh. weakest gun. Like, compared, like, of, uh... Yeah, I what went... Level, what level are these? Get the higher level ones. Oh, the, the level... The ones I want to get, which are a hun over 100, I need the 1,000 uh, rum. Oh, there's going to be another one before that, though. Oh, uh, I will check right now. Hostile takeover events. Did a hostile takeover thing just pop up in your screen? No. Okay, then yeah. Then I figured so. So when you when you unlock it, they'll pop up. Uh. I'm also already kind of in the middle of a plunder event right now, so that could be why. Oh, well, maybe. Like yeah, I had Sherlock's, which was a level, which was sixty, and the one I just got, which was tearing, it uh, it was a uh, ninety. Let's see, fire long gun. See, their singular damage aren't really what they're using for so much as hitting weak points from far away. Yeah. No, no, I'm looking at, like, the the top one, like, the, the ship. Like, the 98 to the ship. Oh, I was talking about long guns, because we were talking about before. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm talking about, too. Because, like, each gun has that, like, rating beside it at the top. Like, beside its name, it has, like, how much it'll add to your ship. Yeah, so far the only other, like all the other long guns, like the enhanced ones, because that's what the Sherlock's original one is, uh, an enhanced long gun you get from his quests. Same with the second one. His second one, he has 110, and it does 2,400 damage. Wow. And it has... Mist breaking, piercing three, and tearing two. Which is the same as his actual guns, but the damage is, is uh, a lot better. It's like doubled. All the other long guns, um, like the better ones, like the other 98, I need to buy from the merchants. From the uh, are the managers. That's why I'm like wanting to make those free, that uh, the want the rum, so I can get the gu get his uh, 110 long gun. So right now I'm just gonna throw on the repair or the tearing that I have on right now, just so I can le basically level up my gun, I level up my ship. Um. Speaking of ships, let me check my ship out. Something, something I wish you could do is add on my map like route markers. 
the swab behind you is breathing down your neck. So that I could just Aye, plot a course in manual on my map and just follow it. Yeah. Same with like it'd be nice if um when I have like the treasure maps, it would just give me a, like the location where they fucking go. Because it's hard to read. Like they do say on the map, but it's hard to fucking read them. So it'd be nice, like, once you read it, it just shows up on your map where you gotta go. That'd be nice. Yeah, so you're... Like, it's, it's not like they're incredibly rare. I find them all the fucking time. Yeah. It's just, it's just too much work for a little reward. Um, I have everything except, uh, sil uh, Shellac. I need two more Shellac. Shellac, yeah. That's shellac. For two. Yeah, I need two more, and then, let, like, I have all the other... Materials for the uh, Bombardi. And then that's a DPS ship. If you want to be a tank ship, like the one I'm using, the Brigantine, the Hall Breaker is a DPS, but it also has like good ramming. Yeah, I do want a tank ship, but I don't have one available for me right now, so I'm going after this, doing this one instead. Oh yeah, I think you have to be a uh, uh, like the Kinkar. Uh, you what? It's the next ship up. It's the Vanguard Snow ship. I forget how the fuck you. I think it's Corsair. I think you got to be a Corsair. Uh. Oh yeah, what uh, what mission are you on right now? Uh, don't know. I'm just doing the ship. Oh yeah, you're just you're for that. For the story, if I remember correctly, I think I had to disguise myself as another ship and do something. I had to go like fuck around and mess with the French. Oh, okay. Yeah, you're doing the um, buddy's mission. Oh. Set sail. Huh. The company and uh, one of the other groups, I forget which one now, where they were teaming up. Uh, where, uh, oh, you're on that. He's like dressed like, he's like making yourself look like one of the French ships to go make their day bad. <laughs> Leaving this safe zone. Oh damn, you're fighting something. Oh yeah. I just saw like you take like a good shot of damage there. Yeah, well, they're a little bit higher than me. But I yeah, wanted like... the sh seven shellac they had on board, and there was two I'm fighting the second one now. Uh, oh, you're up. Yeah, you're up there. That. Then there's the base that you marked. Yeah, I've done the base already. I just haven't removed my marker. Okay. That's for uh, steel ingots. <laughs> so it's shellac, and I come. I've been saying shellac. <laughs> yeah, it's basically it's it's like lacquer for wood. Oh, okay. And like it protects wood, whether whether it affects wood, or whether it treats wood. I have to take on this fucking fort beside me, or take on off fort. That's why ships don't just rot; they're usually treated with something like that. Back in the like now we make it; it's made of like just like chemicals and shit. But back then it would have made it made of like tree resin or something. Oh, that guy's got shellac too. How much more do I need? Oh, I thought I have enough. Well, I'll get him in a photo. Yeah, fuck it, why not? I've already decided he's going down. You should check your uh, captain's log, see what level they are. 
And you might be close, like, depending on how close you are, you might be up. And you might be able to unlock the next ship, like the tank ship. Yeah, then I can just save the materials. Yeah. So assuming there'll be some that cross over. Yes, uh, I think some of them do. Um, let's see, if I take my ledger... Ships. I'm not even close to leveling up, and right now I'm a yeah. Corsair is my next one. I'm a Marauder right now, but I, I like just started it. Yeah, I think you like yeah. You got to be a Corsair to unlock the snow, which is like the ship after. But it doesn't tell me because I have it unlocked already. I mean, I could just push like through this. this level and get it. Yeah. Yeah, I will. Like, I wonder, I forget. You get XP for stuff I do, right? I don't know, actually. Let me, uh, let me blow up this ship. Oh, I'm in the menu. Uh, I got 50 XP from it. Yeah, uh, just sail it up to you. I need ironwood planks. That's what I need. Oh, look at that fish right there. That number right the bottom. Of it. Oh, it's just big now. Yep. I'm the brigantine. Big old fight going on in the distance. They see all the explosions out there. Oh, yeah, there's a um, co op event right in front of us. Maybe that's what it is. Yeah, like those um, ships in the distance there that are in the storm. Uh, which, for some reason, I cannot. Yeah, that ship. That's a co-op. Oh, they have a precision drill bit. Yeah, Mysterious. That's cool. What do I do? Just protect these ships? No, we're gonna blow them up. We destroy them. Yep. All right. Get them. They're not far from the destination, so. We only need the Sardham and the Amsterdam. Doesn't say we need the Northern Lift. But it is one of the marked ones. We probably do. Yeah. I oh, just fucking whales popping pretty much. Shoot my cannon. <laughs> Oh, what did I just... Oof. Oh my god. Oh, I haven't like... Oh, you stuck here. Yeah. I had like, I didn't realize I had a ship basically stuck beside me. Well, there's no fucking chance I'll take these guys on my own.
I need him to follow me, maybe. Uh oh. Ouch. No. 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 Oh, brace. Oh, I'm dead. They mean all the shit is in my hull. Just don't do. That means it doesn't work. Oh. We are ready to shoot, Captain! Yeah, cargo is jettisoned. That's right. Is it? Yeah, you should go get your stuff. And my ship has like a wound. Yep. Which you can get a thing to where um, it fixes itself once you uh, are not in combat. And you can't use repair kits either. No, they don't repair it. Well, I just can't use them. Oh, I have no, that's why. Yeah, you have to go get your stuff. Oh, I went. Oh, I went. Shit. That was good. Uh, yeah. Well, we got them, like, really far into their fight. Or into their, like... I wasn't expecting it to be that strong. I didn't think so, either, being at fucking that level. They're level 7. And this is why they need to fix the repair kits. Also, being able to skip the death animation would be nice. What's wrong with the repair kits? The, um... The fucking time. Like, the oh. cooldown time. No, I think it's fine the way it is. It can't be too easy. You can't just spam repair, repair, and then... You could just fight anything ever. Always. It wouldn't be a challenge. I just go into a fight like a level 2 bajillion ship as long as I had a hopeful repair kit. <laughs> well, at least sense. like the better ones, it would be nice if there's if it wasn't 60 seconds or 90 seconds. I think the timers are fine, but they should be able to be used independently of each other. Oh, so, yeah. Like... Oh, how are you repairing the damage like that? The uh, thing on my ship I have. The one oh, equipment. Yeah, I, don't, I don't have that. You have to go back to port and fix your ship that way. Um, yeah, that's right. Did I get my stuff? Yeah, I get my stuff. You are... Oh, you're that way. Like, those, like, the co-op things would be more fun if people actually did them. Well, they should scale to the number of people who have joined it. Yeah. Like, any other game like this, like Division, you hop into a event like that and it scales to the number of people who are inside of it. I can actually see my equipment that I have. Uh, 
Um, oh yeah, it's the maintenance forge. Oh, I can't see my fucking blueprint now because I targeted the stupid ass fucking quest. Yeah, you just gotta go into your journal. Your blueprint will be at the very bottom with like your your all your maps. Oh. It's not. It's not. It should be. It isn't. Damn it. Well, then I will mark that. Well, you need an iron wood, so we'll go take it out. Yeah, I don't know if I need any more now. Well, I guess I could always use some more, but. Go blow shit up. Kind of annoying. You can't just bring up recipes. Yeah, usually, um, anytime I had to, like, when I was doing that to follow what, uh, anything I had targeted, it would just show up at the bottom of my journal. In the miscellaneous section. Uh, I think you can check if you, yeah, the codex has it. Do you go to codex? You can track it. There we go. Oh yeah, that way too. I need three more iron wood. I need Ramy. Or Robin, how do you say it? You need Robin. I don't even know what they did. I need Robin. Yep. <laughs> the ship workers need to eat, man. Yeah. <laughs> you need that Robin. Can I get it somewhere though? Um That's the question. Yeah, if you try the blueprint. It'll tell you where, like, all the places you uh, can go to get stuff. Oh, yeah, there it is. Uh, at least I can get it in a settlement. I don't know if it's else. Really, Shelly, find a bus and iron planks at this place. I think that settlement has some. I don't know whatever you did, but apparently you repaired a bit of your ship. Or took damage, I'm not sure. I took damage. Oh, okay. I actually have enough iron wood now, but... No, oh, not quite. Oh, because I need planks. I've been collecting raw iron wood. So I, if I went back and, like, did all of them at the refinery, I'd probably be fine, but... Yeah. I'll, it's good to carry some extra, you know. Oh, yeah. Like I said, there's also the place like that I just waypointed that would give you them, too. That's the ones around the corner for me? Yeah, that's yeah. the one I had marked originally. So that's why, like, a lot of other people couldn't get into the game because there was too many AFK players. Makes sense. So they're like, yeah, we're going to implement an AFK kicker, so, like, you, <laughs> they, I don't know if they said, like, how long it is like until you get kicked out but that's a nice thing to like know it should be more than like 10 minutes honestly yeah if you're doing anything longer than 10 minutes then you don't have time again just come back to it oh. Do I have to buy cannons? Rocket. Yeah. Oh, no. I got 3,000 still. Oh, I don't have a little free crowbar for that one. Have you tried torpedoes yet? No, no, I have not. I kind of want to. <laughs> like, they look cool. 
rockets. I just picked up rockets. Like shit. Oh, yeah, I, I had a blueprint for rockets. I was actually gonna change it, change those up from mortars, as they're good uh, for siege weapons. Good. Very hostile due to something. <laughs> I don't think that's gonna hit, but. Oh, it did too. See if that one's gonna hit. That was a long shot. That was. I did not hit. I guess he was perfectly still from where I fired it. I'd have been fine, but he's still at it, so I didn't really account for that. Well, I've been- I'm just shooting, like, the random ships out of the distance there. I forget it. Loot shared, like, I just picked up- Like, uh, it's, eight- It's not, uh, it's not shared, no, like, you get your own loot. Yeah, that's what I meant, like... Yeah. It's individual looting. That's it, that's what, that's what I was trying to think of. And the added benefit of being together is the loot enemies drop is increased. So not only do we get more loot, we get our own loot, which is cool. I'm all for that. Uh, it's coming I'm around like the ship. Playing, like fucking co-op games in your home, we just ninja loot all your shit. Yeah, fucking hate. That is like the big thing with Borderlands that always annoyed me. That's why, like, when they did the the like different looting. In uh, Tiny Teens Wonderland, I like that because it's like no more ninja looting. But it was dumb. Like you open like the shift key chest, and your friends could come along to grab everything before you even see what the hell it was. Oh yeah, have you seen the trailer for the Borderlands movie? Yeah. It's, it's <laughs> Yeah. Who are the fuck? The, the casting choices were definitely interesting. I don't know what the fuck they were thinking. Like, they're all old as shit. Yep. Like, were, were the original Ball Hunter is old? Like, dude, Jimmy yeah. Curtis is 64 years old. She's playing Patricia Tannis, who's like in her 20s. Yeah, it was, um. Uh, like, the fucking. No, uh, what the hell was her name? I forget the girl's name. Who's like 60 years old. Who's playing Moxie. I didn't see who's playing Moxie. I saw the, like a brief glimpse of Moxie, but... Yeah, the woman playing Moxie is 61 years old. Um, and then, yeah, there's like the girl from Halloween. Yeah, do you know who is? Yeah, who's... who's a great actress. Wonderful yeah. actress. I, lo I love her a lot. But why is she playing Patricia Tess? Tess is just the young. Yep. Same with Siren, played by fucking Kate Blanchett. Kate Blanchett's in her 40s, man. Siren's not in her 40s. Not from the looks of her anyway. No, she was about like, um... I think, it, I think they said like... She was in like her mid-20s. She's even older than that. Like in the first yeah. game... They're like, um... I think in the first... Yeah, in the first game I think they're like about... In their mid twenties, early thirties. For the characters, I'm not fucking sure. I think Jack Black playing Claptrap is fine. I hope they roboticize his voice a bit more because he just sounds like Jack Black. Yeah, a lot of people were hoping. Um, like, a lot of people aren't really happy again with like Kevin Hart playing Ronan, or Roland. Roland, yeah, I'm definitely not. Um. What was it? Uh, the guy who played um, Death Death Shot, or not Death Shot? Uh, fuck, he was in the second Suicide Squad movie. Uh, Isaac something. I forget his name. He wasn't Dead Shot, and he wasn't Deathstroke. He was the other Dead Dead something. Honestly, can't tell you the movie. It's so forgettable. 
Um, fuck, what other movies was he Oscar in? Isaac? No, he was um, Poe from fucking Star Wars. No, no, not him. Um. Alright, I head down here to this one. Go loot it for Rami. That's what it's called. Bloodshot. That's what he. Or Bloodsport is what he played it. Um, Bloodsport. Oh, uh, is the guy who gets fucking neck blown off like pretty much immediately? No, no, no. He was the dude who like he was a black guy who was fight who was basically fighting with John Cena. He was the oh, one doing. Oh, he was the one doing like that. about fucking. Uh, yeah, I know you're talking about. I, I, he's in the Hobbs and Shaw movie. Yeah. He's the, I can't remember his stupid name. He's such a good actor too. Shit. Uh, uh, I Diris, I think. Oh, Idris Elba? Elba. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, he's cool. A lot of people would prefer him as Roland. I mean, just pick anyone else. Fucking Kevin Hart, dude. Seriously. Funny thing is, or the weird, the ironic thing is, apparently he's the most expensive comedic actor in the world. Yeah, I can believe that. You know why? Because they fucking put him in everything. Yep. Like the other thing too is like people are with Claptrap with Jack Black. Um, people's complaints are that. They should have got either the guy who did the voice for Claptrap in Borderlands 3 to do Claptrap's voice, or um, go beg to the original voice actor who did it in like the other three games for I'm Claptrap. Yeah, to get him, to, like, get him to be the voice. That never happened. The guy was fired or he quit. I can't remember what, but there was some bad blood there between him and Gearbox. Yeah. I like Randy Pitchford, the uh, director of Gearbox. The uh, whatever. That's why they changed him to begin with. Yeah, because, like, they didn't, um... Cause there was a whole thing, um... There was a whole thing about how, like, he wanted... They never... They weren't, they weren't gonna pay him, like, his standard stuff. Hey, Mika. They, yeah, they, he wanted, like, a bit more money for the third game. And they didn't want to pay him as much. And then, yeah, a lot of shit happened. Apparently, yeah, it was like... The CEO allegedly attacked him. There's a lot of shit about it. Yeah, there was like a lot of rumors and shit about it. But still, like... They could have at least taken the guy from the third game... Who voiced Claptrap and got him to do the damn voice for the movie. Same with... My big thing, too... Is um like Craig or Krog like the bandit? He looks cool. I will give it that. Like he's the only character in that entire fucking movie that looks good. Oh, the psycho. Yeah. The big psycho. Yeah, he looks great. I think is like it's fine. He's just a big meathead with a mask on. You don't really need many people to play him. Although there would no. be better like good choices of people who could play those crazy muscle head characters like Dave Bautista, for example. The chances are, though, he was probably approached for it and said no. Cause they, probably. He said recently that he wants to get into more, like, dramatic roles, and he doesn't want to be known for just being, like... The meathead of a... Gr the other, buff other... meathead guy. Yeah. And it really showed. He was in that horror movie, uh, Cabin in the... No, Cabin in the Woods. Um, oh, yeah. I, know, I remember the one you were talking about. I, I, rem I don't remember the name yeah, of it, but I remember... Cabin it... in the Woods. I'm almost yeah. what it's called. Yeah, and, that, and he was great in it. He was really good. So he's got he's got good skills. He's got potential. I'm sticking that boat right ahead of us. It's got Rami on it. All right. Wait. Oh, I thought that you were looking at the other ship. If he has some, I'm sticking him too. Uh, he had Poppy on him. He was on the other side of the thing here. Oh, see, I can't. I, I don't have the uh, opium unlocked yet. Oh shit! The tower just sunk my ass. Oh shit! Oh, because you're attacking one of their ships, so the. I didn't even <laughs> realize that it was one of theirs. 
Alright. Hopefully it resets my notoriety when I come back. Uh it probably should. It didn't. Oh no, because I, I yeah, because I'm I'm still like fighting them. I'm gonna sail away. Ooh, I did sink it. I, I did sink it. Um, like the other thing too that people are bringing up too with Lilith is next to that, um, where the fuck is her tattoos? Oh yeah, cause like they pulse up when she powers up. Yeah, and they're over her body, like they're shown like over her like her neck and her arms and, um, I watched like uh, Angry Joe react to the trailer and he put up. He pulled up uh, a picture of Lilith from the game and compared it to, like, Lilith in the movie. And they have her covering, like, her arms and more skin than they did it, than they had her in the game. I um, two injuries on my ship. God oh, damn it. Jeez. I need to dock. <laughs> I need to dock so bad. Um... Uh, the part where they're at, like, the city with, like, the blue faces. Uh, like, where they're, like, disguising their face. Uh, that's supposed to be a nod to all the customization choices in the game where you can change their faces to, like, different heads. That has, I, I was, uh, I watched a thing on IGN of the, uh, I think it's the director. He was talking about the movie. And yeah, that, that part where they're at, they're in Sanctuary. Uh, and then the big bad is the CEO of Atlas. Oh, so it's not Hyperion. Interesting. Nope. There is Hyperion in it. Um, because that's where, like, Tiny Tina's base is at, is in the Hyperion vehicle. But yeah, they're, um... It's Atlas that is the big bad, and it's the CEO. Now, the only other thing I will give the game, give the movie that they did really well on is the world. The world of Pandora looks awesome. Yeah, it does. I'm sure they're gonna make a joke about like someone's gun blowing up when it runs into ammo or something. Oh, maybe. Like uh, when they showed uh, fuck the girl who plays Lilith. When they showed her um, hopping over like the like the kiosk, she's actually using the uh, infinite pistol. I need to think some of these, but I need to get away from the cannons, dude. Um. Also, the uh, the vehicle they were using, they actually built the vehicle, like the car you drive around in um, in Borderlands, like the catch a ride thing. I forgot the fuck the actual was called, but they actually broke it, or yeah, they actually made it for that scene for the movie. Uh, it was fully functional and everything. And then they broke it. Because right, <laughs> uh, uh, when I was reading or watching the dev talk about the movie, he talks about how they broke the vehicle. And it was because they got the crew, the casting crew, to take a final photo with everybody on it. And the weight of them all broke the thing. Awesome. Yeah. I need five more Rami or whatever the fuck's called. Alright, let me, uh... What was that lonely ass ship over there in the distance? Can't see him. Uh, he probably does, though. Yeah. Uh, he's got cocoa, zinc, cannons, grilled chicken, and silver on him. I think the one out there's got some. Uh, can't mark his far. Uh, what were you needed again? Rami. Rami? Okay, not you. Mortars and grill. 
Yeah, none of these have Rami on them. This one I'm chasing does, I'm sure of it. It's from their, like, base. Oh. It's got their flags. Oh, I think I see privateers up there. I do. Yep. Yeah, that's the one like, I was checking out. I don't see anything in front of you, so I can't scan it. He's, like, way the fuck out there. Oh, let me see, uh... Yeah, he's still too far for me to even scan him. Oh. Yep, flying Remy. I just tagged him with a bullet. Oh, he's level 9. He's a skull for me. He's all yours. <laughs> he's all yours, big bro. <laughs> I'm oh, coming. <laughs> oh, I hit him though. Oh, that didn't fucking hit. No, neither did mine. Oh, yes, it did. Yeah. Oh, shit. What's hitting me? Oh, probably, probably the smaller ship that showed up. How you doing, Mika? You need level 10. Oof. Oh, God. Oh, God. I'm barely doing fuck all to him. Oh, he blew me up. <laughs> One cannon. Shit. Eh, I don't know how many more times I can revive. Uh, as much as much amount of money I think you have. I keep missing my shots. It keeps overshooting them. Fire the boss hits. Oh, he's out of my range for my freaking uh, my mortar. Yes, yes. Turn into it. Damn it. He turned out of it the last second. Something else blew me up. Fuck off. You know, blew me up. That's two times I've been sunk. Didn't you lose my previous hole? Uh, no. I don't think you do. Oh. If I do, I'm actually in a rage quit. Ah, uh, no. I can't fucking. Dude, I can't respond back at sea. I took too much damage. It forced me to go back to a dock. Oh. Yeah, so it'd be uh. the last dock you interacted with. Oh, it's miles away. Shit. I don't know where you are right now. Oh, there you are. Oh, it was the fucking can't the uh, yeah. the tower. Yeah, because I'm getting shot at by the tower now. Where in the hell did the loot go from that ship? Where'd the loot go? I think I grabbed it. I'm not sure. Now my question. Oh, you're all the way down there. Oh no, that's me. Where the hell? Oh, are you still on the dock? Yeah. Okay, I was like, I'm like wondering, I'm like, where the hell are you? I was gonna fast travel, but I have nothing close, dude. I hope I didn't lose all that stuff. It's not marked on my map anymore. No, I think it's because you're at you're in a dock. I still don't see it. I marked the rough area where it was. Yeah, like I'm sailing around it. Okay. You can't pick up my shit, can you? No. Uh Maybe it'll appear when I get close. I'm like 7,000 meters, so I'm not... I think it's far, but it's not... 
Oh, please don't delete all my shit. I'll be so mad. I'll actually probably sell this game tomorrow if that's the case. I'll be so pissed off. Uh, I don't fucking blame you. Yeah, I've never, like... I've died multiple times, but I've also... I've, uh, like, I've... Even when I've had to respawn at the dock, I've always had my stuff. The reason why I probably had to respawn at the dock is I didn't have my money yet. I didn't even get to my fucking previous body. Yeah. Well, you keep your cash on you. It's all your in like all this stuff on your inventory. Oh, then it's because I took too many injuries on my ship. Too many, like, critical Yeah. Yeah, that, yeah, that's probably it. Well, it made it worse. The one ship that hit me, it started to flood my ship. I had to use a res restoration kit. It was just slowly taking my health away and causing permanent, like, ship wounding. Yeah, I should actually change something on mine to where it, uh, it, it uses that. Uh, I have one set on my main page just for that. Oh, is it restorations? Yeah, add that to that. There we go. Well, I have the up and down D-pad for that. For, like, the different uh, angles on the ship. Yeah, that's what I want. Yeah, and then, like, the left and right are, like, my food and my repair kits. Yeah, me too. But then it's where I have the other wheel. I have the top right set to uh, restoration kits. Oh, Okay. I'm not sure what there was originally, but it's gone now. Yeah, I got the top right of my, uh, or the middle right in between, like now set on the first wheel, so it's right there. Wow, wow, wow. Hello, kitty. Are you going to say hi? You going to say hi? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Who's shooting at me? Oh, just like rogues, other pirates. Yeah, just rogue oh, shit. Um, if you see my, yeah, you should see my waypoint right there. There is a closest like uh, smuggling outpost, our closest outpost. I don't see it. At least not. Oh yeah, yeah, I do. Yeah, I haven't been there yet. Yeah. Actually, I wonder. Um, planks, fiber. Yeah, I don't think I was able to pick up. Wait, I have how many cannonballs left? Oh, I was going to throw them once. Those are my mortar bombs. I was like, how am I already down to 400 cannonballs? I should have like almost... Three grand. Yeah, so you sank like close by that uh, tower guard tower. Oh yeah, so I got a taste earlier of the um, of uh, the plague damage that's coming in season one. Because at the bottom, where the Dutchman's camp is, at the bottom of the map, there is a fucking tower, a guard tower, that is part of the fleet of pestilence that shoots plague balls at you. Oh, nice. Yeah. And they are not fucking fun. Like, they, they hurt. Ah. Hello, kitty. Wow. I'm close <laughs> to the area, but I'm not seeing any fucking map markers. Yeah, I think more when you like come into the zone, you should you should hopefully see it. 
Right, I'm not in the Ring of Fire zone yet. I'm in the Nylum Sea. Yeah. I think when you get into the Ring of Fire zone. Oh, there you go. Hello, kitty. Oh. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Just trying to get, trying to get the mic to pick her up, pick her up, like meowing. I hear. <laughs> like the only thing I can think of is because you're dying so much. Hey, like took your loop back. Yeah, I don't, I don't even know. I don't know. Because, yeah, every other time I've, like, even when I wasn't able to, when I had, actually I had to go because I had no money back to camp, uh, back to a camp, I was still able to come get my stuff. I don't see it anywhere, man. Check, uh, check the codex. Make sure, see if you have, like, I did double check on like the ship for like if you have the materials it might be in like your warehouse. Oh. oh. Well I'm being attacked already, please don't. Yeah, I just watched you sail into them. Wonderful. Oh fuck this game dude. Yeah, and he's like camping your stuff now. Well, and I have no fucking corpse in the map for that one either, and I just sunk. Weird. So like, I have no clue where my my body's supposed to be, or my original one, or anything. Yes, Captain, as you wish. Oh, okay. I just picked up a bunch of weird shit. Yeah, I'd say let's get the fuck out of this seat. Oh. Fire the buckets. Sailing the fuck away. That thing hurts. Hey everybody, welcome to the room. I wonder if that tag I did actually was working. Ah. I think I see some, like, crates floating out there. Yeah, the crates floating out there were from, uh, your ship earlier. Uh, I'm gonna leave them, bro. Oh, God. Alright, come on, 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 two fucking seconds. Are you kidding me? It was right at fucking zero, too. Okay, can I skip the death animation of my ship sinking for the hundredth time? Ah, oh, I'm back, motherfucker. Yeah, okay, so I just died, so I see my... my thing. Man, I just...
Now, the other thing I could think of is because you spawn like having to go back. It it allowed me to pick up your stuff because I did pick up a bunch of crap, which I thought was from the other ship. Maybe you have to check your supplies. I'm sailing to this like one smuggler that's doing your marks. Yeah. I'm. Oh my god. Leave me the hell alone! Just wanna repair my ship and get the fuck out of here. Oh my god, why? They need to jack down the radius of the fucking searches. Like, I'm nowhere near like the campaign, like the campaign of ships, but they're ones turning now as they got suspicious of me. Attacked already. Oh, yeah. Dead. Oh, fuck this game, bro. What? Uh, yeah, because we're fucking hostile with them. All because I'm I gotta. Fuck all with them. No, yeah, it's because I'm hostile with them because fucking getting attacked by that goddamn merchant ship. You, uh, you left the session? Yeah, I'm gonna see if I can reload in and see my fucking body. Okay, because yeah, it just said your stuff was dropped. Ugh. Oh yeah, there's so many fucking ships, like... Okay, so that last shipwreck is now on the map. But all my previous ones are gone, and I lost all that stuff. Oh my god, dude, that... I actually might sell this dude for that. That really pissed me off. Well, that's sort of understandable. That was a lot of work just to have my body disappear. Yeah, the game fucking bur bug out on you. Well, and then just get stuck in an area where I can't leave. It's like, okay, I died, cool. I'll respawn and see you go get my body and leave. I respawn and then immediately shot dead by a cannon. By a fucking turret gun. It spawned right beside it. Blew me up immediately. Didn't have a chance. Didn't even have an opportunity to sail away. Just blew me up. Dead. An actual fucking meme of a game, dude. So frustrating. Well, that too, and like the fucking area, it's just like. Uh, like, they're spawning all, like, the French ships, or whatever the fuck it was, or the DMC, or the Dutch ships, and it's like, I get attacked by a different fucking ship, and now I have the Dutch ships on my ass. Hi. Can I buy anything from you? What do you sell? Mortar furnace, bombard. Make your shit coin and piss grog. Like, I'm on a fucking island, and they're still searching for me. It hasn't gone away. There we go, set sail. Players joined your group. Yeah, I never, yeah, I joined your group. Oh. I don't even actually see you on the map. I'm on port. Okay.
No idea what one though. Probably some area I can't set away from because it's too high level. Um. What was the, the last area you went to, or last port? I think it was the uh, the Telok or the Punjit, or whatever it's called. That's where I am, yeah. Yeah, the Pirate Den. Yeah, yeah like. The one other thing that annoys me is when you discover an outpost, the only way to unlock fast travel is docking at that outpost. And, like, you can't fast travel to me, which sucks. Um, well, I'm gonna give up on doing that, just fuck it. I'm not gonna collect all that shit again, just to fucking crash and burn. Uh, send trade request. Just telepathically trade with me. <laughs> uh, so, what do you have on you? Like, what could be possibly mine? Actually, I was gonna fucking it. I had Rami, I had like, um, I had about that many too. I didn't have the screw mechanisms. I had Saltpeter. What was the other shit I needed? Saltpeter, Rami. Saltpeter had a uh, stash, so I didn't have any of that, as far as I remember. What the fuck was the other crap? I can't check in here, can I? Uh, probably not, no. Yeah, no, you definitely didn't have my mind because I had, I had a big stack of ironwood, like just standard logs. I had probably oh, okay. thirty logs. Yeah. So, yeah, no, you you didn't get it. You probably could have gotten my last bunch when I quit the game, oh. but that was nothing. There was like some rusty nails and shit, stuff I picked up on the way back, after sailing eight fucking kilometers, just well, getting blown up in an instant. Yeah, which fucking sucks, like. Um, but yeah, check out. Uh, oh, yeah, check steel. Whatever. That's right. I had a ton of steel and shellac. That was the other shit I had. You suck one of those bastards that hunt pirates, hey? I say, those are hell. Yeah, shellac, I think I only have two of. Uh, let me fucking find what it looks like again. Like a jar of goo. Like a barrel of goo. There's black. Yeah, shellac. Yeah, I got uh two. I was stuck piling fireworks here. Uh what else did you need? Dragon with them. Leave them for the uh, celebration. Steel ingots? Times fifteen, I need three more Rami like and four shellac and then I could build it. Steel. I guess I could source out some of that, but it just sucks that are you fucking dead? I know. Alright, steel ingots, shellac, and what was the last one? Three Rami Rami was was called. Flying Remy. Yeah, that's it. I think the commodity traders just got it for sale. No. Happy travels, <laughs> right, because it's not a commodity, is it? It's a it's a material. If you only buy the materials from like the basically the zone they're from. Uh, uh, yeah, or like traveling or smuggling merchants. Into it. Do you need mortar bombs? I'll take mortar bombs. I have 20. <laughs> I have 400, but I'll take them anyways. That's all I got. <laughs> hey, pretty lady. How are you? I'll store that. So now I just need two shellac and I can build it. 
And I guess you need shellac too, so that's that's what we're going to get. Yeah. I'm gonna open uh, store Actually, I really don't wanna lose it. Hold on a second, there's um Oh yeah. Uh oh. Oh yeah, sorry. Terry uh, another cannon. Terry Terry Cullivan three. Actually I wonder. Come here, I'm gonna I wanna see if I can do this. What are you doing? Car uh receptionist. Ah damn it. I was hoping because it was a uh, a thing out of a chest I could give it to you. The fucking cannon I just got. Oh, but you can't because I'm not high enough uh, rank or whatever. Yeah, because uh, yeah. it's a kingpin chest. Um, you had to be. I wonder. Actually, I wonder if I can give you that other. Um, that 200 one that I made. The helm or the armor. Back again. Oh. Which, uh, maybe. I, I already have pretty good on mine now, but. I'm not sure what it is. I'll tell you what mine is right now. Hold on. Yeah. So I have two uh, level 260s. My current one is 195 Iron Husk 3. Yeah, I got a high Iron Husk 4. I have two of them. I don't think I put on 4 yet. Um. I guess I could Freedom check via the blacksmith. If there's a blacksmith here? Yeah, there is. Uh, it's uh, left uh, on yeah. the dock. This way, yeah. Uh, I I, sprint faster. Let me sprint. I forget, what are you? There. You're a 98. Blacksmith. You're a tearing. I had a long gun for repairing three, but it's... There's the other gun, gun I got from a chest. I wonder if I can try give you that gun. As if it's a story mission gun. Well, I bought a ballista bolt kit by accident. Um, Where are you? By the boss? Yeah, mess? I can buy it from him, so I'm assuming I can probably also use it. Iron yeah. Yeah. yeah, and I, ha I have it on me right now. And if you talk to the um, uh, the merchant uh, who has like the talking parrot, she gives it to you for a fucking quest reward. But oh, I, can just, cool. I don't want to talk to you. I wanted to talk to you. I was too close to the blacksmith. God damn it! I yeah. bought the blueprint for the Kelvin Four because I think I have Kelvin Two on mine right now. All right. Let's see. Can I give you this? I can give you this. Sweet. I can yeah, that. cool. I give you that. It's a long. Oh, it's for the front too. Oh, sick. Yeah, it's a long gun. That's uh the story machine gun you get from them. So. Uh, oh, it looks cool too. Let me put it. On. It is. Uh, I guess yeah. the benefit from you going away for five days and you've been playing out stuff. <laughs> Yeah, the commodity trader. If you talk to her and do her quest, yeah, she'll give you the uh, iron husk for free. Which I wish I knew that before I fucking made it for my ship. All right, so I can't give you that one because that's a king one. Um, oh yeah, I have basilisk one on the front of mine. That's right. Yeah, basilisk level one. Uh, yeah, okay, fifty-two. All right, here. I'm. I wonder if I can give you these two. These are Cullivan level fours. Oh yeah, nice. I wonder if I can give them to you if you might. Oh no, you just bought the blueprint for them, didn't you? Yeah. Yeah, so I should be able to give them to you. You two? Yep, I got two. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Oh, they were just so much better than mine. Shit. Hey, yeah. The other thing is, I lose my, um, I lose my bonus, because I have, like, the Basilisk has, like, bonus effects on it. Oh, yeah, you got the enhanced ones. I do. Yeah.
but the base damage is better. So like my current ones, they're yeah, Basilisk one. They do fifty two, or sorry, they're level fifty two. They do six twenty five, but they have increased charge rate of vulnerable effects by fifty percent, and adds twenty percent of the damage is piercing damage. So it does piercing as well as just standard cannonball damage, but the other ones do a thousand damage. So there's no way I'm not trading them up. Like the one, the ones I have right now on my sides are Basculus Two, actually. Um, I have them on my on my side, and they do um, Raider. So they increase my charge rate for vulnerability effects by fifty percent, and they do Piercing oh. Two. So they added 20% damage to piercing damage. Which... I, I now have two tearing Cullivan 2 guns, or 3, which are better. They're 98, and they do increasing tearing damage. And the What's damage... What's the burst damage? 1,029. Oh, so they're technically better than the ones I'm wearing, even though they're number they're enhanced number twos. That's why. Oh no, the basculists, uh, and the basculists two, which I don't think they're enhanced. I just think they're the. Well, they're. they're oh yeah, they're, they're enhanced. Stronger than the yeah, they had they'd have to be. They're stronger they're than the. Like, uh, oh no, so, so it's a little bit weaker, but you get the bonus effects. So, yeah. Same yeah. Thing. But it's uh, the 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 Terran uh, Calavarian three. Their base damage is a thousand twenty nine, but I only get tearing, uh, tearing two. The damage goes down a bit, but the reload goes up, and but I lose the other uh, a couple effects. Yeah, so this is the thing too. I have a repair long gun, which puts my sh uh, thing up just a little bit, but I lose damage and it turns into repairing. So I'm guessing I don't repair like any like ships. I just do. I don't damage any ships other than just repairing like you, or like whoever. Um, oh, right. I wonder if I can actually make that and give that to you, too. The, oh, yeah. uh, uh, the maintenance for the furniture. Oh, yeah. I forget if I have the blueprint for it or if I got it as a reward. I think I got it as a reward. But it is very good because it heals your ship when you're out of uh, combat. And that's not the person I want to talk to. Uh, yeah, the carpenter, the tree man. Oh, oh no. What do I need? Uh, oh, zinc, juniper, and sheet glass, and I can make spyglass level 3. I'll find that later. I can make the hunting spear level 4, though, but. I really use it. For... Uh, no, I don't want that. What the hell is it? Oh, no, it was, there's this one. Okay, here it is. A maintenance for it. Oh, I gotta find the blueprint. Can be purchased from the carp. Oh, it can be purchased from this dude. Hold on. Oh, let from me the buy guy it. we're standing in front of. Yeah, yeah we're standing in front of. I can buy it. Busy day today. Lots of All right, what's it take? Fine rhythm. Oh, sh sh yeah. Uh, shell. Uh, Shellic. Oh, weird. I can't buy it from him, though. Oh yeah, maintenance forge. There it is. Yeah, fine, Remy. All the shit I need to make the new ship I'm trying to build. Yeah, it takes it. Yeah. Yeah, that's all right. I'd rather build the ship first and then worry about furniture after. Yeah, I don't blame you. So we need a shellac then, both of us. Yeah, so shellac. Really so we should probably go do that. We'll yeah, let's go some. sink something. Uh, let's see. I should have um, shellac. Uh, nope. I have no food on me. My ship sunk with all the fucking food on it. I didn't, I didn't get it back. 
Oh shit. All that all that grilled durian down the drain, dude. Right. I had coconuts. <laughs> I had like 170 grilled coconuts. Oh. Remember you gave me like 200 durians? I cooked them all. Yeah. They're all I'm trying down. to give you more. Like I'm, I don't want no fucking <laughs> fruit. God, how many is gonna be this time? Uh. And what is it? It's like fucking three thousand bushels of bananas. <laughs> What is that? Oh, grilled fish. fish. Oh, okay. Well, that's alright. Oh. My, my guys aren't vegan anymore. <laughs> I like seven durians. Okay. <laughs> of course. Naturally. Okay, let me go. <laughs> I'm going to leave my coconuts so that if I sink, I only lose 40 fish and not fucking 170 uh, coconuts. Yeah, I don't believe you. Now, I haven't really been collecting food, like actually food, food, like grilled food. Oh, yeah, there's rocket ammunition. I'll put that away. The ballista bullets, I'll put that away. I have all these gems, which, like, you can go and sell, and it's like, I haven't sold any of them. Oh, uh, you're sitting on a small People fortune, then, probably. Shit. Oh, yeah. Alright, so we can get shellac from Kenker. It's a settlement, so it's probably gonna be pretty tough to take down. Doesn't say what level it is though. Oh, the Gartel is level six. Uh so that's a spot. Uh yeah, it's level seven. You can see it in like the top like left corner of the page when you live at the oh, settlement. Yeah. There's a train route up here if you'd rather just steal it from ships. Probably easy to try to take it from a settlement. Uh, they're level 9 up there. So maybe not that far north then. Um, well, shit. Uh, what's your ship now, anyways? With everything Six? else? 6 on? Yeah. It says 5. Oh, I haven't got it back in, but uh, it's 6 when I sail. Okay. Um, it hasn't updated for you because I haven't actually set sail yet. Oh, okay. What are yeah, they? Oh, yeah, what are the cookie station? Well, I tried to find the cookie station and went to the blacksmith. <laughs> Where is yeah, the cookie station? Um, there we Where is the cookie station in this place? It's like from the warehouse, you just take a right. Or if you're facing the warehouse, turn left. But the first turn, turn right. It's right there on your right hand side. Okay. Oh, yeah, there it is. I see it. It's actually yeah, across the blacksmith. Grill fish. <sighs> What's kind of annoying, too, is I should be able to fast travel to any location that I visited. At least any outposts. Yeah, you can. You just have to be on the dock for that to do that. And then, like, then you get the outpost, um, or get the fast travel for the outpost that you've been to, as long as you oh, dock right. to them. So I yeah. have to dock to this one if I want it. Okay. Yeah, which, like I said, is dumb that you have to actually dock to it first to then unlock the fast travel. It should just be once you discover it, it should give you the fast travel. I agree, because what's the difference? Just a load screen? Yeah, that is literally it. It's a fun, you have to load onto, the, onto it to then load back into your ship. Did you attack something? No. Why the hell am I being wanted already? I haven't even left the safe zone, and apparently I'm getting... A dark and cursed looking. Out. Yeah, I, I apparently have the DMC wanting to kill me, and I literally just got onto my ship. So, Yanita showing you how to swim, eh? Uh. 
Alright. Uh, where are... You're 1.k kilometers away from me. Yeah, I docked at whatever this place is called. Oh, um, the one yeah. the car just the, look at. Yeah, I'm marking where I'm heading. I think it's got salt Peter. Yeah, I gotta make my way. Make my way there. Ooh, dude, that cannon shoots super straight. That long gun you gave me? Yeah. Well, that's what I was using on my ship for the longest time. Again, why why do I have the DMC off my butt? I need I just pull that. I'm attacking somebody, but it's, it's not the DMC. No, like, I had them attacking me even before, like, I left the settlement. Or the outpost. There, I've now discovered this fucking thing. Can I leave it? Oh, there's treasure on that outpost for me. It popped up right as I was, as I was like leaving it. Okay, there's treasure on this outpost. I'll try to find it. Bright light. Bright light. What I might do is buy all the... All the stuff they have here, and then just think it. And then just, like, plunder it after. Yeah, might as well. If I can. If I can. Oh my god, this place is big. Oh, hello, flaming tower thingy. Don't mind if there was some powder on you. Stamina boosted up, baby. I don't even know where the fuck this like, thing is. They sell shellac for three twenty three thirty five each and they only sell one at a time. Oh there it is. <laughs> I'd sink them just for that. Ah. Are you here? Not yet, <laughs> I'm I just found the fucking treasure chest on this island. Oh, cool. I, I have no idea why, but when you unlock, get a completed treasure, did you notice how much XP you get for it? I've never done a treasure. You get one XP. Really? Yep. That's gotta be a mistake. Like, you get a bunch of stuff from the treasure, but when it comes to XP, you get one because that's every time it's done that like tonight that i've been playing this game i get one xp from the maps all right mama way there's a rammer another thingy another thingy Actually, I don't know if they're part of that. Nope, there you are. Uh, uh. Go. I 
just have a fucking tower. Oh, God. Oh, oh, I fucking missed the tower. Bird, baby, bird. Okay, that is you. Yeah, my bombard in the back is getting kind of weak now. There we go. This is a place for plundering, right? Yep. I'll be good. I wanted to make sure I didn't just start a plunder on a place we're not doing. shellac that's what I want that'd be I think it's like a, a blue what yeah it's, at the end? I don't know it's a green so yeah it'll be like one at the end oh, which way are they coming in right here God damn, what am I right now? Oh, King Finn 5. God damn. Uh, nope, I didn't get any that time. I noticed too, if you shoot on, like shoot at them, it makes the bar go up faster. Is it really? Yeah. Like if you shoot on to the town. I don't know if that's gonna hit that ship or not because I didn't. Oh, okay, good. I couldn't see where I was aiming.
That's another player. <laughs> nice ram. Hey, ram. I just got really oh. close and shot. <laughs> oh, it looks like you rammed through him. Can we get a loot after doing no work? No, thank you, sir. We will need a bigger boat. No. Uh, oh, shellac I got that. three. Oh, yes, I did. I got three also. That means I can make the ship. Yeah. I need to go back to port. Oh, that's the... Oh, he's oh he's using a sloop. Oh, he, he was waiting for us to do our shit before, like, he could do anything. Keep my eyes open if anyone else with shellac because we want more. Cannonballs. Let's see. That's time deal. Oh, I got time. Oh. Yeah, it's only one thirty. I need to take out fucking goddamn military bases. Man, I'll get my ship all kitted out. Maybe I can help you. Yeah. Do you need salt, Peter? There's guys there with salt, Peter. I don't even know what the fuck I need anymore now. That guy there is crude salt, Peter. No, I don't. Like, I actually need some to craft. Like, a new mortar or a bombard. I'm going to get some. I'll see when we get back um, what my old one is. My bombard that I was using. I think it was a 60. Take them all! Fire the muskets! We didn't have to think that guy, but we're gonna do it now. Yep. He was here. Might as well take his stuff. Aw, oh, I think that just missed him. Back to base we go. Wait. We're, we're back to neutral because all the fucking witnesses are dead. It says we're neutral, but I still have the fucking thing at the top. I'm now hostile with them still. I went neutral with DMC and now I'm neutral with these guys. Or slightly hostile with these guys. Yeah. I, I still have like the DMC saying I'm neutral and I'm apparently hostile. Oh, there's Durians there on the island. Maybe I'll collect a good like 140 and give them to y'all nice and cooked. <laughs> <laughs> there's some iron wood, but it's already been cut down. Kind of funny. Even if the NPCs cut down the tree, you still have to wait for it to regrow. Meow. Hi, kitty. You just shoot the NPC and cut the tree down. Not know. true.
Hi, kitty witty. Whoop. Do some bombs. 